all right you guys asked for it so you're gonna get it here is a revisit of the old house that there might have been a ghost in might have not been uh, it's full of all kinds of old stuff let's get up there right now and take a look at it There she is. All right, little history about this place. Um, when this village was first settled back in the 1870s, um, there was about 18 families that lived out here. So about 18 different homes. And this is one of only two of the original homes that are still left standing. Um, if you want to look back at my videos, we found an old graveyard. It's also in this area. And the people who used to live here are uh, buried in that cemetery. They died back in the 20s, I believe. So this could have been empty till then, or since then, sorry. She's ominous looking, that's for sure. Here's an old uh, shed. Old, that would have been where the barn was right over there. All right, see you guys in a minute. Sorry, the camera cuts off, but uh, here's an old stove you guys like so much. Beautiful old thing, look at that. I'm glad we get a chance to come back here. I just want to get this on video before this, something happens to this place. As you can see, there's stuff thrown everywhere. That's an old mirror. Holy jeez. The old hat's still hanging up. Man, what a spot. All right, let's look in the pantry. All right, here's this. You can see, not too much in here. Old iron, a few old jars and whatnot. Behind me, the old little washing machine. All right, we're gonna keep on looking around here. Old dad's root beer bottle. Let's keep on going. Underneath the stairs. inside the house. You guys see that? It's a bird in the inside of the window trying to get in. Oh god, the cellar door is open. That was not open last time. Wow. Someone has been in here since last time we were here. Here's the sewing machine. Wow. Poor bird. Similar, the same brand. There's the old organ that still works on the play because I don't attract attention to me, but that poor bird. Okay, all right, let's head upstairs. One more shot of the sewing machine. 
Okay. Oh my gosh. This is scary. Here we are, upstairs. Here's an old record player, I believe. An Amphion? Here's a bedroom. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. Oh boy. I'm not sure how much I like this. This place just has this kind of vibe when you're in it that it you just something like something wants you out. Here's the doctor's bag, guys. You wanted me to look inside. But it's empty. I can tell right now. Sorry. She's empty. Here's the last room. A couple beds in here. Probably a kid's been, it would have been a kid's room. This place freaks me out so bad. Hope that bird got out. There's the old beds, guys. See, there's books everywhere. I think I set these here last time I was in here, these old plates. There's still some clothes hanging in the. in here. There's a calendar from the 30s in here, remember 1936? Oh, you scared. There's the attic. I'm not going up there. Sorry. But, uh, yeah. Wow. What a spot. Right, we're going to look around a little bit more. We'll catch up to you if we find anything cool. We'll close back here, I just realized. Old jacket and dress pants. Anyway. Here's where that ghost apparently was. I think we can determine it's not a ghost now. Just because I came up and I, I looked right here, and I think what we saw was that piece of fabric hanging. So that at least makes me feel a little bit better. <laughs> this place isn't haunted. All right, let's head back down. Poor bird's still stuck in here. Okay guys, there's only one place left to go. It's down. Well, it turns out it's not a cellar, it's a closet. <laughs> Always thought it was a cellar, I never bothered to open the door, but... You can see you just got some real old-fashioned stuff hanging in here. Like I said, this house is old, old, old. 1870s it would have been built. Nobody, you can tell no one's lived here for a long time. Oh, there's birds over there. I'm gonna try to get that bird out of here, I don't want him to die in here. But yeah guys, that's been the tour of the house. Hopefully you all like this video. I know the brightness isn't messed up like last time. I'm able to look at stuff in a little bit more detail. I'm really glad I got to come back here. It's a shame it's a little bit more erect, but that's just how it is, I guess. I'll take one more look out here. Running out of power and film, so. Who knows what will happen to this place in the years. I'm just glad we got to look through here before anything bad happens to it. Hopefully you guys like the video, and we'll see you next time.